Hey guys, welcome back. This is Chiquito PC. Hope you enjoyed the last video. I told you I was gonna make another one. And you guys remember when I said this line? I will definitely make that as well. I'm making it tonight. So you'll see the same shirt, same you know, layout. But I'm not sure if I have time to upload it today, but it's definitely gonna be done today. I'm definitely gonna film it today. Well, that was a lot of shit because as you can see, I am not wearing the same shirt. Anyway, the second awesome content that I have for y'all is happened to me around two years ago. Two years ago, I was, I was dating this girl that lived pretty far away from my house. It was like a whole train right away. I had to take a bus and a train to like the very last. It's, it, was, it was just too much. It was too long. I almost fell asleep one time. It was funny. Ad. On the way there, I had to go past a very specific place. A very specific place. And then, for, for some of y'all who live in Australia, oh, you, guys, you guys are going to know what this place is. Dandenong, you know. Victorian people in southeastern suburbs, we know what Dandenong is, okay. But alright, so I was just going past Dandenong with my headphones in. And, and when we stop at Dandenong, some bitch walks in, looking like the love child of Gollum, and that's from The Exorcist. So... Like, I was just completely confused, because she walked in yelling at everyone in the bus, like, she's, and the train as well, because I, I could see as she was coming from the bus, she got off the bus, and a person that was on the bus with her walks in and sits near me, and I could hear them talk conversation saying how she was yelling on the bus, and I started yelling on the train. So this, this, this was going on for quite a while, I, I, that's, that's what I got from all this. But she walks in yelling at everyone on the train saying, Where the fuck is my mother? And I'm like, holy shit, this girl is losing it. So I was like, in my head, Jesus, Emily, no one gives a shit where you put your light on. Stop yelling at us for no reason, alright? So she says yelling at everyone, pointing at people saying, Give me my lighter back, and I'm just like, we don't have your lighter. And she walks up towards me, like, because I was staring at her for too long. I was completely just shocked and, or well, judging her, obviously, because who wouldn't? She says, she says, you walks towards me, pointing at me, saying, you, what are you looking at, you bitch? And since, obviously, I, I, I was just completely scared, and I was out of it. I not, no, no English came out of my mouth. I said speaking Spanish to this bitch. I, I, I was like, uh, no hablo inglés, perdón. Just like looking at her like, I, 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 don't, I don't know what to do. And she's like, excuse me, you dumb Mexican. I said, what are you looking at? And at this point, I was like, excuse me? So I insulted her and her heritage in Spanish. Right, I decided swearing at her in Spanish, calling her names. I was like, Mira, puta, si me llamas otra vez, te voy a dar un coñazo en la cara y vas a perder. ¿Sabes qué? Por eso te da mejor, te voy a decir eso. Como te da una mujer, si hago, si hago fea. O sea, por Dios. Vete ve, ve, a un salón y ponte un, una máscara o algo ahí que te das como una. Es como una. una como si fueras si fuera un zombie que vino del. del de la Halloween hace dos años. Soy así o no más. And then I said that, right, to her face. And she looked at me going, like, You know what? You Mexican, I'm gonna go. She walks out, starts yelling at everyone. If any of y'all took my lighter, I'm gonna f find you and I'm gonna kill you. And I'm like, how many shit do you have to? I know this is a junkie because I've seen junkies. I've been to Fenty Gully, but like, how how cooked do you have to be to walk into a train? To just walk into a train, right? Start yelling at everyone. Almost catch hands with a Mexican, which I'm not even Mexican, by the way, as you guys know from my last video. How, but how cooked do you have to be to do all that and then just walk out and not even go on the train? Like, she, she gets off at the next stop, walks out. So for the whole train ride to, to my girlfriend's house, or well, two years ago, right, because I... I'm not, I'm single now, but that's just a completely different story, which I won't tell because it, it's, it's lame. So on the way there, I was just confused and wondering what is going on. And the people in front of me, they turned around and they said, I'm, I'm, if you don't understand this, I, 
I'm pretty sure you at least understand what the word I'm sorry is. So I'm gonna apologize for that dumb and then I said, oh no, I speak English. I was just, I just couldn't be stuffed arguing with this woman. And they were like, wait, really? And then we started having a conversation about how I speak Spanish. And then, oh, it got pretty cool. But the funny part was when they, when I told them that I speak English, I just couldn't be stuffed dealing with this bitch. I just spoke Spanish to her and I insulted her. I told them what I said. And they were just completely going out of it. They were like, what? Really? And I'm like, yeah, yeah, it is. So yes, guys, that was... The story of the junkie on the train, mate, honestly, I, I could not even deal with this. It was just, it was way too much. Like, this, this actually happened. But, you know, who knows? On a side note, as well, in Dandenong, right, on the, on the train, four men walked in. They looked like they were going to jump me because, you know, I was wearing Adidas, so I was scared. But as they walked past me, I heard them whisper said, nah, he looks too broke. Now, I'll catch you guys later on the next video. I actually have content for it. So, if you're lucky, I might even film it after this video. Well, that was a lot of bullshit. But, that I might also I have to have to edit this video. And even and I said last video, it's going to be two videos a week. But, maybe you're lucky and I'll upload three this week. Last one when ask. But, y'all, yeah, I'm ready. You know. I'll catch you guys later. Ciao.